Daily satellite picture in the radar, and here comes our next big piece of energy in the upper atmosphere. It's pretty strong. And look at all the rain and even some uh, snow, most of it's snow, especially once it gets into the mountains. And it's already starting to move into the northern mountains of North Carolina, as you can see on Live Super Doppler 4 HD. A few snow showers and flurries, really from Burnsville all the way up to Boone. And then we'll start to see with this northwest flow, more snow showers become more numerous, especially along the Tennessee line. So a winter weather advisory kicks into gear in these areas at 8 o'clock this evening, and it goes until 11 o'clock tomorrow morning. Expect an additional 1 to 3 plus inches of snow in these areas. And the heaviest snow will be toward the Tennessee line in the higher elevation, especially the west-facing slopes. So with this piece of energy comes in with the northwest flow, it hits that uh, western mountains in the top. You can't go up and over, so you could see, easily see 3 to 6 plus inches of snow before it's all said and done by really noontime tomorrow. So active alerts, there's the alert mode because of this advisory, which starts at 8 o'clock this evening. Don't expect any precipitation, though, outside of the mountains. At best, maybe a flurry for the northern part of the upstate late tonight, early tomorrow morning. So at the GSP National Airport, we only reached 55 degrees this afternoon. As you can see, that's nine degrees below average for this time of the year. At the Asheville Regional Airport, we started off at 30, only warmed up to 45 degrees, 13 degrees, if my math is correct, is correct, below average for this time of the year. Remember, a week from today is the first day of spring, and it certainly doesn't feel like it outside. 54 degrees, very cool in downtown Greenville with a southwest breeze at 13 miles per hour, humidity low, and it really feels like the upper 40s because of that breeze. So even in Nashville right now, plenty of sunshine, currently 43 degrees, north wind to 10 miles per hour. It feels like 37 degrees with the wind chill. In Spartanburg right now, it's 52 degrees, low humidity, a southwest wind light. In Anderson, sunshine, currently 54 degrees, a west wind at 17 miles per hour, humidity only at 28%. 39 already in Cullowee. You can see how cold it is, especially in the mountains and even in through northern North Carolina. It's only 47 in Raleigh, where they had about two or three inches of snow yesterday. 35 in Cincinnati. They had some snow from that storm system in the Big Apple. 41 melted away most of the snow. Different story, though. Look at Boston still with a blizzard warning continuing for the next several hours. Anywhere from 10 to 20 inches of snow in and around the Boston area before it ends after midnight tonight. Tomorrow in the upstate, still unseasonably be cold, but at least we'll have sunshine and increasing breeze out of the west-northwest tomorrow afternoon. In the mountains, unbelievably cold and windy. Upper 30s, that's it for highs. Uh, scattered flurries and snow showers early in the morning, then tapering off by noontime tomorrow. So there's the big snowstorm. This is at 7 o'clock this evening up in the northeast. Uh, northwest flow snow showers along the Tennessee line as we go through the overnight hours. Still a pretty good batch of energy coming in, especially early tomorrow morning in those North Carolina counties that border along Tennessee, and then everything starts to lift off to the north. Northwest flow starts to back up a little bit, and it's still going to be unseasonably cold tomorrow afternoon. Tonight in the upstate, low 31 degrees, breezy at times with mostly clear skies for tomorrow. Even with sunshine, very breezy and quite chilly. High temperature only in the upper 40s uh, to uh, upper 40s to low 50s. Northwest winds at 12 to 20 miles per hour. Four day plus looks like this. So we're talking about sunshine uh, on Thursday. Otherwise, very windy conditions, as you can see, but at least it'll be milder in the afternoon. High 66, even milder yet on Friday. High temperature 71. Northeast wind, cooler temperatures with a chance of some rain on Saturday. Sunday, at least it gets milder. And so we'll have a 50-50 weekend. Rain on one day, dry the next day, and then scattered showers early next week. Four day for the mountains, just down on cold. Uh, leftover flurries scattered around in snow showers tomorrow morning, but milder on Thursday afternoon. And then just scattered rain showers Friday and Saturday. So we're slowly getting there mm -hmm. as far as temperatures wise, but not tonight and tomorrow, that's for sure. All right, Sean, thanks. Okay.